Hello, Frank. You called me this morning to tell me something important. Yeah. Hi, Ben. I'm sorry to bother you, but I need you to do me a favor, please. Sure. As long as it's not money. Because I don't have much money, you know. Well, you know I live with my parents and they are old, right? I think I told you about that. Yeah, I remember that. You told me you lived with them and also with your brother and your sister. Yeah, well, they are old and they can't work anymore, so I have to pay for many things. Well, I took some money I had been saving for many years and now I don't have anything. I just need $500 to buy some food and also to pay for some things. I promise I will give you that money back at the end of the month. Please. Well, Frank, I would really like to help you, but I don't have money right now. I mean, I have $500 in my bank account, but I need that money, bro. Please, this is an emergency. My parents are sick and I need to buy medicine. Also, I need to get my car fixed. You know it broke down last month and I've been taking a taxi. Yeah, I know, but... Seriously, I don't have that amount of money now. I'm sorry. I think I can lend you $100, but that's all. I'm sorry, Frank. Only $100. No, that's not enough. I need more. Much more. I also need to pay for a bank loan I asked for the last year. The bank never waits. We had to ask for a loan because my father got fired from his job and we didn't have money. He has been working hard all these years, but now he is tired and sick. Poor my dad. He has worked as a bricklayer, a carpenter, cleaning toilets, selling products, anyway. He didn't study at the university, but he could always find a job. He's very strong. And my mom. She had to clean houses, wash other people's clothes. She was a cooker, a seller, a cleaning lady. Wow, she has worked really hard too. We come from a poor city far from here. I didn't have many opportunities. I had to work hard to get this job. My sister is studying at the college. She has to get the best grades, so she can get a scholarship because we are poor. My brother is in the school and he always uses an old uniform. I feel terrible about it. His classmates make fun of him for being poor. Can you believe it? Damn. I promised him that I would buy him a present in Christmas, but I couldn't. You know I have two jobs. I work here and then when I leave, I have to go to my second job. It hasn't been easy, but happily, I could get that job. I am thankful for that. Seriously. But Frank, last day I saw you drinking alcohol in a bar. Where did you get that money from? Oh, that day. No, no. One of my friends invited me to have a drink. I was so stressed with all these problems that I agreed. That's all. Um, well. But you bought a new jacket. That brown jacket you're wearing now. Yeah, but it cost cheaper than you think. It had a 50% discount. Come on. You are my friend. I need your help. Just $500. Um, I can give you $300, but that's all, Frank. No, that's not enough. I need $500. Please. I am desperate. 
If you don't lend me the money, I'll go crazy. I can't sleep at nights and I can't think clearly. I can't even have lunch or concentrate at work. I don't know what to do. Oh, my God. I think I will get sick if I don't get that money. Then, I won't have money to pay for the hospital. What am I gonna do? I will have to sell my car, my house, my parents' house. Damn. All right, all right. I will lend you the money. Five hundred dollars. Don't worry. Really. You're the best friend in the world. Thank you so much. I promise I will pay you back, Ben. I will give you six hundred dollars. No, no. Don't worry. Just give me my five hundred dollars back. Of course. I will give it back to you at the end of this month. Thank you so much. Yes, please. Because I need that money to pay for some things too, so. Oh, of course. You don't need to worry. You will have your money back for sure. Hey, Frank. I was looking for you. It's the end of the month, so. Hi, Ben. Yeah. It's finally the end of the month. What plans for today? I don't have plans for today. I am just going home to relax and to watch a movie. Oh, that's great. I'm going to celebrate my friend's birthday. It will be awesome. Yeah, I suppose. It's been a hard month. We all need to distress. Ha ha ha. Exactly. Well, I need to leave. My friends are waiting for me. Take care. Hey, wait. It's the end of the month. I need you to give me my money back, please. Money. What money? What are you talking about? Ha ha ha. The money I lent you three weeks ago, remember? Five hundred dollars. Oh, that money. Well, I don't have that money now. I will pay you next month, okay? Next month. No, I need that money now. I have to pay for some bills. Yeah, I know, but I don't have five hundred dollars now. I can give you one hundred dollars. A hundred dollars. No, you owe me five hundred dollars, Frank. I need my money back. Why do you insist so much? I'm telling you I don't have money now. I don't have it. If you want, you can take the one hundred dollars I'm offering you. You want it. I need my money. I have to pay for some important bills. Please, Frank. If I'd known you were so pushy, I wouldn't have asked you for money. Goodbye. But, Frank. Oh, my God. What am I gonna do? I need that money. Dear listener, I hope you learned from this video. Don't forget to subscribe or thanks for watching.